So YouTube just released a new app for editing videos that are filmed on your phone like this one. It's called YouTube Create. YouTube also announced this week that they're going all in on AI. So we're gonna talk about both of those things and what they mean for content creators like you and me. So starting with YouTube Create. The YouTube Create app is basically gonna let people easily edit shorts and full form videos from our phones. And the app is totally free to use. This is a pretty huge update, especially for things like shorts, because let's face it right now, the shorts video editor built natively into the YouTube app kind of sucks and it's kind of hard to pinpoint parts of the video you want to edit. So having a YouTube built app that makes the process of editing and creating shorts a whole lot easier is really going to speed up everybody's workflow, I'll bet. And one really cool feature that I was especially excited about is called cleanup. So basically, if you've recorded a video and you have some background noise, some buzzing, some static, whatever, you just hit cleanup and it'll help clean up the audio for you. That is pretty huge. In the past, we had to use tools like Denoise or things like that. It was just more messy having to use different apps to do one thing. And we also get access to YouTube's royalty-free music and sound effect library right out of the YouTube Create app, which is also really cool if you're editing on the go and you need some stock audio to spice up your videos. Another cool feature is if you are running your video on top of some music, there's an option called Find Beats, and it'll actually find all the beats in the timeline of the song you've used so you can sync up your video to the music. That's actually pretty slick. So yeah, basically YouTube's giving us a way to easily edit shorts in a way that aligns with the ways that people like to consume shorts. They're adding that type of functionality right into the app, which is really cool. And while it's definitely nowhere near as powerful as what I use, DaVinci Resolve or Premiere Pro or Final Cut, it gives you just enough to do everything you need to do on a mobile device which is huge. Love it, I'm excited about it. Right now it's available for Android. I can't wait for it to come out for iPhone. So the last thing I wanted to mention in this video had to do with AI. So along with YouTube Create, YouTube also announced that they're going all in with artificial intelligence in a way that should help creators do a better job creating better content more efficiently. Sounds great. Things like generating new video ideas, simplifying the editing process, you know, creating creative backgrounds, removing backgrounds, you know, making suggestions, all, all things like that. So basically, YouTube wants to make it as easy as possible for creators to create by leveraging AI, which sounds cool, but I think it warrants a bit of a disclaimer. A disclaimer aimed at the brand new YouTubers who are just getting started with their YouTube journey. So all these AI tools are going to be great at making the creative process easier for us. I don't deny that. But if you're just starting out and actually want to grow on YouTube, I would recommend that you don't rely on them. You should be focused on growing your own unique style and character, figuring out how you like to edit, figuring out how you like to script videos, figuring out a flow that works for your unique voice as a creator. Because ultimately, there are a lot of creators. And once everyone starts using AI, and if you're just leaning on AI and you have nothing unique about the stuff you're creating that's unique to you, why would people watch you? So I think it's important. New creators, starting now in the advent of all these AI tools to make life easier for us, figure out how to create yourself first. Then lean on AI after you've gotten into a groove in something that works for you to make your workflow easier, not to totally replace it. That's my two cents for people who still want to succeed in making money on YouTube, even with AI. So anyways, that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Cheers.